Justin Ra, and in this video we are going to talk about the second aspect of galactic jungle music, which is uh, the electronic rhythms and melodies that I use. And before I get started on that, I just wanted to uh, reiterate what all these videos and the series of videos I'm, I'm going to be putting out are going to entail. So the first 10 or 15 videos are going to be all the instruments that I play and explanation of how I got into that instrument, and then I'll show combinations of me playing instruments at the same time, because I do that live. And I'm also going to, you know, show the equipment that I use and the way that I had to create, you know, like my pedal boards and thing like things like that. And I'll share all that stuff with you. And then after all that, after the introduction, all the videos are gonna be just me looping, live videos, um, and just the progression of Justin Rob music. Even hopefully my videos get better. Um, I'm just starting out with this so uh i want to show that progression as well me just doing these home videos to you know maybe some epic crazy multi-can videos later in the future um so yeah that's pretty much what these are going to be about so let's get started uh, so with the electric electronic parts of justin ron music it started off with my brother and his friends technically they're like my brothers they were making beats and uh they were using an mpc a Korg Triton, which is what I use now. Um, they were using two like rack mount like modulators or uh, they, they were just like extra sounds like a Motif and a Proteus, I think that's what the other one was called. And they had them all set up to where they can trigger each other like via MIDI. So the NPC could use the Triton sounds and NPC could use the, I think it's Motif and Proteus and Triton could use the Motif and Proteus. Uh, so, I was like, wow, that's amazing. I started making beats on that and I just fell in love with it. So I used to take it home and I would make beats. And so the, the song that you heard in the beginning of this video is actually one of the first songs that I made uh, making beats. And this song or that song was actually going to be the first track on what I wanted to call Galactic Jungle Music. And the album that I released, Age of the Spirit, that was actually going to be the first song on Age of the Spirit. But, you know, I did all these things with the electronic music. Thanks, Ben, for, you know, mixing it all and stuff. Ben Jost, super awesome. Um, but I, as I was doing it, I'm like, how am I gonna do this live? I mean, I love music so much and I love playing live that I want to do it live. So in the process of creating all this, I had to figure out how I wanted to do it live. So. I took a step back from just making the beats and wanted to figure out how I can do all this live. So it took a little while, you know, bouncing around band members and, you know, things like that to where I, I talked to a buddy of mine, Sean, and he was like, hey man, you should get into looping. So I did, and then I discovered looping my keyboard, which should have already been a eureka moment, but I discovered looping my keyboard and I can loop the beats and the loop the electronic percussion um, parts. So that was just, okay, um, Eureka. And that's when a Galactic Jungle really started. Um, so yeah, um, I would make beats with the NPC and things like that. And it was super fun, but I really wanted to get into the live parts. So yeah, um, thanks again for following Justin Ra music. Uh, before I go, I just wanted to talk about, so as I'm making these, or making these beats, I wanted to understand what I was doing. Some of the some of the rhythms I was using, like one of the songs, which I might post in a later video, I think the, the count would be 21-8. And I didn't even realize that, I just made the song. And once I started wanting to learn this thing, it's like I came across this book, I think my ba old band members left it, but this book right here. And uh, you can tell that it's just been beat up and I've taken it everywhere with me. I've spilled wine on it, and tea, and it's been everywhere. And I've read it a lot over and over. And some of the stuff further in the back, they get into like C clefs and double flats and sharps. I understand those things, but I have more of a grasp for more of the beginning of the book. Um, but still, I'm always learning. And But yeah, I read that book over and over after I started making beats, which really helped me understand music a lot more. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to share that with you. Uh, started off just making the beats and then I learned the music. So what I like to call, I learned the emotion and then I learned the math. 
so I can combine them together to create this awesome uh, experience and musically. So yeah, thanks again for following Justin Ra. Um, you can find me on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, which is this, uh, and Instagram, Justin Ra Music, all across the board, and justinra.com. And I'm going to leave you with an, another one of the songs that was going to be, I'm pretty sure this was the second one I made, um, that was going to be on the album, Age of the Spirit. And this song is kind of important to me. Like, it's it's a nice, it's about six minutes long, and it pretty much shows you the transition of how I went through the creative process uh, electronically um, from beginning to end. So definitely watch the whole video, I, or watch the or listen to the whole song. I'm just going to put like a little background for you, but listen to the whole song and I hope you enjoy. Thanks again.